Breast cancer is the most diagnosed cancer worldwide, contributing to 12% of cancer cases and 30% in New Zealand. BCE MRI is the gold standard diagnostic tool for breast cancer. During MRI, a contrast agent is administered which highlights the tumour location and its boundaries. In uh, the face up position, a standard MRI can be obtained. However, it is very hard to distinguish um, the tumour between surrounding tissue in uh, a standard MRI. Uh, you can't take a DCE MRI in this position um, due to uh, the, the nice setup you have um, in the prone position. Uh, so not being able to see the tumour in the face-up position uh, is, is uh, very difficult. And so people have proposed um, that image processing techniques be used to map the contrast um, enhanced information that you have in the DCE MRI to the standard MRI in the face-up position. However, standard image processing techniques typically fail to estimate the motion between face down and face up due to the large and complex motion that occurs uh, um, in the breast tissue between these positions. Furthermore, uh, clinical techniques uh, do not uh, highlight the tumour location and its boundaries in its entirety, and this contributes to 20 to 40% of patients having to undergo multiple surgeries. I'm proposing a hybrid, a hybrid biomechanics and AI approach to overcome the imprecision uh, of current clinical techniques. Uh, so biomechanics approaches are the current state of the art for this task, however, they um, can't account for all of the motion due to approximations made uh, in the models of breast anatomy and tissue mechanics. On the other hand, AI leverages neural networks and extensive data sets to learn the motion and provide models which are efficient and um, can pick up components that have maybe been missed by biomechanics. Uh, so the ultimate goal of, of this approach is to have the biomechanics do the heavy lifting and then have the AI pick up the residual components. And so um, the impact of this will be to provide clinicians with a, a method of precisely locating the tumour in the face-up surgical position. And um, this is important because uh, during breast cancer um, treatment, uh, residual cancer tissue can be left behind. And in this case, um, reoperation is required. Um, so the ultimate goal is to uh, provide this method so that um, reoperation rates can be reduced.